10 and 5. Just practicing the analysis and evaluation of the last exercises, pattern training and the over the board games in readiness for the over the board competition in 12 days time. Let's just take and take. So there's only these minor details that need to just be looked at. So these games that I'm playing in these last 12 days are really just solidified, well, attempting to solidify these behavioral issues. They're only small issues, but we just need to get them ironed out and feel even more happy uh, with our progression. I'm going to just support the pawn. He's feeding Chetowin, but he's blocked anyway. He's probably going to try and get rid of this and stuff. Yep, all right. And let's x-ray through to the queen. So we've got the minor pieces out. So we're happy. Queen's coming for the B pawn, so we may as well just push this pawn up. Or the rook, whichever. Yeah, it's, oh, excuse me, it's chomping at the bit to get this down. Could go here looking to disturb the bishop. We'll just move the rook off of the line. This knight doesn't have any protection. Queen can still come and put a check. We push here. Space here for the queen. 211, it's protecting 211 at the minute. Oh, there he still wants to push here. It's got a 211, rook can come across. Let's jump the queen in, blocking this pawn from attacking here. Of a free pawn there as well, but I'm not too sure if I want to open that up yet because he will have all of this. Hmm. Okay, so we're attacking, so we'll take, could take with the queen, looking to get the queen off the board, or just takes back with the bishop. Oh, we don't have to do any of that, but I just feel bringing the bishop back, and then his knight starts attacking. We go here, he drops down again. We go here thinking we're getting this pawn. Let's just keep here and see if there's any, excuse me, any dice with getting some pressure on here. Maybe not. <sighs> okay, so have they just given the knight up or have I fallen into some sort of trap? He's attacking the queen. I'm going to take. He's got the bishop here with his queen. And they're plus one. My gosh. I saw none of that. None of that. Queen can take. But he's on my knight. <sighs> oh, wow. I saw none of that. Attack the bishop. Get the pawn back, but I'm not looking to pawn get back. Attack the bishop. Queen's all alone. 
my rook is going to get hit because he's going to give us something to think about because the bishop has got the diagonal it's not doing that just yet we could take but then the rook comes here x-raying through to the queen so we're not getting that back Ooh, bring the rook here Rook comes to defend Can't do anything about that The rook does come to defend This pawn is still being defended Could hit the queen Knight takes, bishop takes, no that ain't happening. I didn't see that at all, damn. So the plus one, I mean they can't really be too happy with their position though can they? Could hit the pawn, takes, rook takes on the queen. Making trying to make some space maybe to get this support going. So I've just got to expect the unexpected and just try and keep improving my position. A little bit like what I'm trying to do here. Um yes I got shocked, but then we Jumped back again, trying to put pressure onto weak areas, attacking the bishop, attacking the pawn. So kind of giving the opponent something to think about. Queen's moved across as he got my knight. So we're probably not getting the pawn back because the bishop's just going to take and be on our queen. Bishop takes on our queen, we take the pawn with a check on his king it's a shame his queen's protecting this pawn knight I always think of knight moves but then it's you know it's not meaty enough Knight takes, bishop takes. Oh, it's got space there. We take, the bishop takes because he's got support from the queen. Attack the rook. I bet he takes with the queen and that messes everything up then, doesn't it? So we take, takes with the queen. So it'll be equal then. Takes with the queen, bishop takes with the check. King moves. Yeah, we can't go then. Can't go there then. Okay, let's take. It's a queen, queen. What? Ah. Uh, yeah, they're seeing the fact of the bishop that's putting the check on, but they've given us a pawn. Let's just break it down though. They've given us a pawn. I think the bishop's better there, isn't it? Rather than the rook, or is the rook better? Because the rook's facing. But the Yeah, they can just come here. But if we've got the rook here, the rook's more powerful here, isn't it? 
But it's just going to take with the queen, and is it a waste of time, the rook being there? We'd have one, two, three. Oh, maybe not. Let's take with the rook. And see if there's pressure on this pawn, no matter what happens here. Maybe there isn't, because if he just takes with the bishop, he can't do, sorry, can't move the bishop because it's got the x-ray through. And even if he takes with the queen, we get the queen for free because the bishop can't take back. So I don't think that's going to be on the card. So what? knight takes. Oh, don't forget this rook. Queen's on the rook. Knight takes. Bishop takes. Rook takes. Yeah, I think that's straight forward. Rook takes. Oh, I knew there had to be some sort of fancy business, didn't there? Take with a check. Every growl I've made in the game, we seem to have turned out okay in a better position. Yeah, we can't get the bishop off the ball, but we can put a check on the king. With the rook, actually. Checkmate. Nice one. Let's have a look at the analysis on that one. Pawn pushes down, bishop comes back. Just in this situation here, what's it? It's saying just take take the knight. Just take the knight because currently, yeah, like with this pawn is blocking the bishop anyway. I just didn't really want a queen exchange, I don't think, maybe. Spring it back, we were focused on this pawn, weren't we trying to get pieces on there but it all kicked off right so that exchange still left us with a one a plus one and that was our first grunt when the queen came down and they'd actually got a pawn up but we said let's go and see if we can get this bishop and attack the pawn the d pawn and we start doubling up so not doing anything really bad at this moment apart from this pawn move it's not a fan. It's saying just get the other rook involved. Simple potatoes. Okay, it's still in the pluses, but it's uh, dropped one point. Queen goes back. I did think that was okay. It was like supporting the pawn, but we captured. Oh my lord, look at that. I knew something wasn't right, didn't we? But we took it. We took it. This is saying knight e4, bringing the knight back. I'm sure we mentioned that, but we said, oh, well, we always end up doing knight moves, and it, it didn't look like there was anything clear. Although there is something here. Oh, there is something here. It's so clear as day, isn't it? It's got like a fork and the queen. Bishop takes, queen takes. That's a nice oh my life so we captured the pawn that was a bit erroneous but we felt okay because we had a plan didn't we we had a plan of putting pressure towards here so fair enough it wasn't the best move but we had a plan it felt comfortable they moved the king out of the way because they can feel some sort of plan coming in it's plus seven i don't think we did plus seven actions so we took the pawn after a deliberation it's not happy with the knight it's saying rook what rook takes the g7 oh g7 huh rook takes g7 oh god it's gonna be that isn't it queen takes d1 oh no we're not having any of that oh it takes d1 yeah, but do they not just take? 
and then he takes his queen d6. It might be a little bit too arty for me, dude. No, okay. Let's just go back, back, go back. So what else was there? So we brought the brought the king game back, and we took with the knight. It's saying, yeah, we're not. I don't. I'm not seeing that. <laughs> I'm not seeing that. That's way too fancy. It would have been better if it was more straightforward, but like it's showing the queen taking, taking. And we get a queen, but yeah. No, I will stick with that. Stick with that, stick with that. So it does drop seven points. No, in fact, it's like mate in 12 situation. Let's look at this one again. What about even pushing this pawn? Yeah, pushing the pawns better than the knight move. Yeah, because what did they do? I mean, takes. Then we go boom. And then where does he go? Um, Where's my finish? There's some sort of finish, isn't there? Could just come here. See, it's into this rook taking the thing thing, isn't it? Just to give it space. Takes. King takes. Queen e7 check. Where does he go? It's got two places to go. Where's the mate, dude? Here. Oh. Oh, I've got a rook, you know. But blam. Yeah, that can work with that one I'm still missing this making space for the rook thing so I don't think I would do that but I should start thinking along them lines if I'm in these sort of positions yeah I'd probably go for some slow slow stuff like this or whatever and that's probably wrong it does drop queen takes the oh with a check no we can't do that Go here. No, you can't do that still. Ooh. Ooh, yes. That's too fancy, isn't it? No, you can't do that. You can't do that. It's all about this rook, isn't it? So we'll do a slow move then. Queen takes C. Oh, I've got my knight. So he's got lots of pieces. Move the knight. Get it into here. Right, nice one. 